So if the only way you could save my life was to have sex with another man, what would you do? Oh, I'm banging him. You're a cheater. You what? literally just thought about having sex with another man. No, I'm you literally just thought alive. about. You You're went through so it all of it. You see this? You see this? <laughs> I'm saving your life. Let me die. Oh, no. Has anybody ever looked at their wife and been like, damn it, damn it. Without being rude, you know, I just want you to know that I think that maybe dinner tonight could have been a little bit more seasoned. It was a little on the plain side, like watered, watered down chicken. You make me fucking twitch and like glitch, make me have a seizure every time you talk. <laughs> You know, it's just so shitty sometimes how you gotta clean this shit up right here. You know, you just gotta clean it up. You just gotta clean it up. Come here, baby. Give me a give me a give me a touch. Give me a touch. Give me a touch. So if I die, will you marry again? Like another woman or Yeah. I don't know if I would marry. Uh, I kinda wanna get out of the marriage now, so I'd probably just have girlfriends. I, I mean I don't mean that like offensively. I just mean, you know, yeah. Then how do you mean that? Like, if it's not offensive, how do you mean that? Because like, you know, it's just, you know, it's just bonded, you know, you feel enslaved. So I would rather be like more free. I will wreck this car right now. I love you and all, but if you ever dress our baby in a mustard colored shirt again, you're going to have to catch up to us as we leave. <laughs> I love when you slide my meat in your mouth. <laughs> oh my God. I mean, both of you are just absolutely stunning. Her too. You guys could shave a few off, but just a, just a few. A few what? A few what? <clears throat> a few what? Shave a few what? Pounds. Listen, guys, we are a prime example of why brother and sister can make beautiful children. Okay? No, we're not. But step. Step. So, if you guys are in a close family, make no. the leap. It's crazy after a long, hard day, right? I have to come home and cook after working. What do you do here? You. You're right. <laughs> Why are you such a bitch? What? Is, what? I said, follow me on Twitch. No, you didn't. TV forward slash so Emperor Dees. Okay, so I saw this thing that says that the average man sees about five women a day that he wants to sleep with. That's not his wife. How do you feel about that? Like on Instagram? No, just like in general, five women a day. Like out in public. I think it's a lot more than five. How many? Like 50. Andrew. But we don't, I'm not going to do it. I'm no, married. I'm, I'm married. I love but, you. But the marriage, I'm just I'm saying, but like the we'll natural feeling of testosterone flowing through my body where I want to just rail that girl. It's like, but I don't do it because I'm Your honorable. daughter is listening. Shh. I'm going to cry. No. Right now. Tears of joy because I love you. You know, your nails and your toes look great. But if you don't do something about that hair on the upper lip. Andrew. Like, how can you go get your eyebrows waxed but not your lip? You know what I'm saying? I got my, I have a beard. You don't need one. I'm glad you finished your dinner. Hope you save room to finish me later. That was so far out there. It's a colonoscopy. They call me Dr. D's nuts. <laughs> this is just some advice, but maybe when we go in public, you should put makeup on. Okay. This is just some advice, but maybe you should worry about growing some hair. That's body shaming. That that's body shaming. I'm sorry. <laughs> hey, what's the name of that really hot coworker you have? What's her name? Esmeralda. Yep. Yeah. You said that way too fast. I meant like she's on the hot seat, she could get fired. <laughs> you guys look like the plot to the next Star Wars movie. I mean, Empress Ray, 
and Darth Bitch. Damn, sis, that belly sticks out about as far as them titties do. Yeah, they do. Ew, stop. <laughs> so everyone on TikTok is telling me I should leave you. I think it's time for you to know I want a divorce. Well, at least you signed the prenup. And now I can just rail girls. <laughs> hey, babe, here's your drink. <laughs> I'm gonna give you guys some life advice, all right? If your wife or significant other leaves the house for a significant period of time and you want her to come home quicker, don't respond to her text messages. You know what I mean? Just don't don't answer them. Don't text her back. Don't answer the phone calls. Turn your location off, okay? And, and, and she will, you know, she will, she. She will, she will come home faster. Hey, these aren't the beads you put in your butt, right? Why would they put that on the pacifier? Yeah, they stop. I'm just, it's a, She's what are, an infant. What are these beads for? This isn't spring for break. This ain't spring break. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, okay, there's your Mother's Day card, flowers. Your gift is a gym membership, you know, for health reasons. Okay, so for Father's Day, I'll get you some steroids for your scrawny ass. That's messed up. That's fucked up. Okay, fine. I'll get you a Sharpie for your hairline. <laughs> what? Good God, sis. You put the man in memories. You know what I mean? You pick one of the things up and drop it. That baby slide right out of there like, yeehaw! <laughs> I don't know who needs to hear this, but the person playing this really, really loud wants to clap your cheeks and then take you out for some motherfucking ice cream. Can I get a thumbs up if you down? I don't want you to, like, take this offensively. But I've been considering divorce. Just because, you know, all you do is take care of the children, cook, clean, my laundry, you know. And I'm just looking for a little bit more excitement in life, you know. I didn't think that it was going to be so boring. So... You want me to beat you? Ooh. As you can see, the mother sow saved none for her children. Gobbled down every bit as the children fend for themselves and die. I just love it when you hold me like that. It reminds me of the last time my mother touched me. When, like 10 years ago? <laughs> yeah, can you slap me so I can remember what she felt like? Um. Here, babe, I gotta fix something. Let me just, let me fix What are you doing? Real quick. Let me just, you know. Have you lost yeah. your Yeah, like just, yeah, there we go. Yeah, mm-hmm, yeah. All right, yeah, that's better. I'm oh, calling, yeah. I'm calling, I'm calling, I'm calling. <laughs>